Hello, darlings. We're here for the first of two lectures on the reproductive system. We're dividing the fellas and the ladies into their own separate lectures. This is the only system in our study of anatomy where we divide up the ladies and the fellas. Even though there are some differences anatomically between us, the differences are irrelevant except for when we're talking about the reproductive system. So uh, as you probably know at this stage of the game, I find the reproductive system quite fascinating. And this is an image that I show in my human physiology course of the whole point of our reproductive systems, the fellas. In fact, you might even argue the whole point of everything is the production of sperm for the fellas and eggs for the ladies. And everything we do, you might argue, is geared towards successfully meeting sperm and egg and making a little baby. I like to call those little things parasites. It is what it is. They are. Unless you've had one in you, you can't argue. They are. So uh, I borrowed this image from my human physiology course. I actually was preparing the lecture for this course back before I was flipping one night, and I had a small five-year-old child come out of his bedroom and crawl up into my lap and cuddle with me and then look at my computer and look at this picture right here. And he said, Mom. What is that? So of course I had to tell him, dude, sperm and eggs, it's awesome. And he looks at me and he says, Mom, can I draw that? Of course, son, I would love you to draw that. And this was his drawing. Now, now you can imagine some of the challenges that my children are going to have growing up, <laughs> the poor things. But the number of times that I've had conversations with my friends saying, um, <laughs> well, your kid was over at our house playing this weekend, and I just thought I should inform you that my children were teaching him about sperm and eggs and what happens when they combine. I've had lots of my girlfriends start, you know, twitching and, <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. You know me. I don't have a hard time talking about it. So the whole point of life is the reproductive system. And really what it comes down to are differences between males and females. Everything that is set up to make sperm and everything that's set up to make eggs, there's one difference. Are you ready for it? Ready for it? Okay, here it is. I have an X chromosome. The fellows have an X chromosome. I have another X chromosome. The fellows have a Y chromosome. Chromosomes, DNA. I have two X chromosomes. The fellows have one X and one Y, and that is the source of all the differences between males and females. In this lecture, we're going to start out by looking at how actually we really are mostly the same, and we just have some weird stuff that happens under hormonal influence, you know, when we're inside our mama's bellies. And then we're going to go in and spend the rest of the lecture talking about the fellas and looking at the gross anatomy for fellas. We're going to uh, look at how they go through the process of producing sperm, and then we will spend just a little bit of time talking about the marvelous structure, the penis. And I will be back to start on what you looked like in your mama's belly when you were six weeks old. Peace.